Paul. How are you? Hi, Horacio. Good to see Hi, you. Hi, Paul. Good to nice see to meet you. Yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> yes. Uh, welcome to uh, Cello Bello. I think tomorrow is the official launching of the, your incredible database of Latin American cello music. Thank you very much. We're really grateful and honored to be part of Cello Bello and you know, to be able to show the, this work that's been going on for a few years now. I'm and sure. It's, it's, it's very it's, exciting. We have admired Cello Bello so much over, over time and, and your work, of course, helping us all and now just feeling that we're going to be a part of it. It's extremely exciting for us. Yes. Well, it's exciting for us too. I mean, it, it looks like a real treasure trove. I, I spent some time going through the catalog and uh, so much music I don't know, so much music that looks so interesting. And uh, so how many entries are there? It's about 2,200 entries so far. I see, yes. So, yeah, so. When I started the catalog, I, it was say like 500, and a few months later, it was like almost like 1,200, and it's been going up, you know, every day almost. Wow. <laughs> I see. Well, as as fast as a composer writes, you have to keep updating, I guess, huh? Yeah, that's a, that's a hard that's a hard thing. But you know, now some composers are in touch with us directly, and they write emails, and they send some of them even send their music, you know, for us to have as a database. So, I think things are going to work as as we go along. They're going to work much better. Wow. Yeah. Well, we have a, another section of the site for twenty uh, first century cello works, and uh, composers send in to us also. But this is going to be uh, a tremendous compliment to that. And of course, you go back in history. But, um, and, and, but also another thing I'm excited about is that I think our, uh, I'm not an IT person, but uh, you and my technical people have worked it out. So you will be constantly able to update uh, for us. And we will stay current with, with your research and what composers are sending you. Yeah, it is very exciting. As, as Herman said, uh, the more this word spreads, the more composer write us and cellists all across Latin America and Europe and everywhere. And so we have new works. We have kind of set some dates where we will have time, of course, to sit and update the catalog. And, and yes, we will keep it up to date. Yes, and it's part We're of- We're counting on you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, and as part of our project, we are trying to promote uh, uh, composers and cellists from Latin America, you know, making small videos so they are more well-known. I mean, if, if they need to be well-known, we can kind of give them a push by giving them some attention. Well, I mean, there's so much incredible musical talent, uh, you know, uh, all of Latin America. And uh, interesting that when we look at the demographics of uh, Cello Bello and who uses it, uh, there's a lot of usage from Latin America. So it's one of the reasons that uh, we're so excited about being able to add this. I, I, I think it, it really fits so well with, I mean, there's a lot of people down there that play the cello and uh, want cello lessons and are hungry for the blogs and the articles. And I'm sure they're gonna be excited about this, uh, this uh, resource also. Yeah, that, that's the idea. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, tomorrow is the 1st of May, and when you wake up in the morning, uh, you will see your catalog uh, on the Cello Bello website. Yeah. Incredible. <laughs> We're sitting there ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> yes.